800 families, 800 homes. Habitat for Humanity dedicated its 800th home in Baltimore today. WMAR 2's Maria Morales brings us the celebration. Habitat Chesapeake is celebrating a milestone. 800 homes, some new, some newly renovated, all going to deserving families, including families of one like Tom Mosdinsky. I was living in a rundown roach and mice infested apartment. It should have been condemned, not knowing how I was going to afford a better place to live. I never imagined that just a short time later I'd be given the opportunity to own my own home. Mosdinsky said he thought Habitat's home ownership program was just for families with children. A co-worker encouraged him to apply. I'm grateful for this program and those uh, that helps those of us who are single. Four townhomes were dedicated in the 1100 block of Church Street in Curtis Bay. Among the new homeowners is Kanika Neal and her two-year-old son. With the help of this program, donors and volunteers, I'm able to give my son a home where he can grow, laugh, and continue holiday traditions. The homes are sitting on what was a wooded lot. Community members say that attracted all the wrong things. Now they say they're excited about what the new homes mean for their community. This community has long been disinvested and now we're starting to, um, we're bringing investment and we're starting to see other investments. So we're really excited about these homes, the community members and the people that are going to live here. Deborah Dallas agrees. She pastors the church directly across the street. She and a few church members welcomed the new neighbors with gifts and hugs. So happy to have them here. And I, like I told all of them today, I said, you may be neighbors today, but I embrace you as our family. Habitat also celebrated two new homes in Pigtown. They were completed earlier this year. Mosdinsky lives in one of those homes. I'd like to say how much I love my house. I've always wanted a townhome in the city ever since I was a little boy. My row home is gorgeous and it looks like it's built to last. Volunteers are busy putting the finishing touches on five more townhomes on the same site. They will be ready in August. In Curtis Bay, Maria Morales, WMAR2 News.